we are here to experiment. So, yeah, see what happens. Oh my god, that's, I know, I can't. 
Because after the commitment ceremony and the way in which you were talking to each other, what we decided was to reach out and debrief about what happened, but also how you're talking and what we can do about it to give you guys a better chance. If we go to that fight that happened at the commitment ceremony, what do you think really were the triggers for all of that? Um, nothing to talk about, I guess. The first opportunity to talk to someone at all was with you guys. It kind of bottled it up to some degree because it went from zero to a hundred very quickly. I don't think I have been bottling it up. I think I've maybe been quite vocal. I've just felt highly attacked and obviously highly degraded and disrespected. And just the fact that Bronson waited then and there to expose all of this stuff before I even heard it. So you have this different style. You're not keeping it in. You're getting it out on the table immediately. And at the commitment ceremony, it kind of got thrown in your faces immediately. How did you feel about your own behaviour in the commitment ceremony? Going back to you, how did you feel the commitment ceremony was and how you acted during that? It happened. How did you feel about your behaviour? Yeah, I mean, it all happened so fast. 